Morning ESM. I'm Isabel. And I'm Gabby. Now let's go on to Josh with news. Rutgers will be holding a drive through flu clinic at the fairgrounds this weekend. The first clinic will be Friday from 8 a.m. to noon for seniors age 65 and older. The second will be on Saturday from 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. for ages 2 and up. An appointment isn't necessary, but you will need insurance and a card and a photo ID. You'll have to stay in your car and make sure you wear your mask. The clinic will be in Gray Lot, Gate 7. You must use to get in. The annual Christmas tree lighting ceremony hold, held in Crittenden Square is canceled due to coronavirus pandemic, according to Syracuse officials. City officials say they will be in the tree lit. There will be no public in-person per ceremony. Department of Parks Commissioner Julie Lafayette said, for such popular tradition, we do not believe it's possible to host an event within people gathering requirements and keeping COVID safety recommendations. Harrison Asian short clawed otter at the Cornish Seal Sanctuary had been having trouble finding his partner at Apricot and died recently. His keepers kept up a website and called him fishing for love and he can't find another partner. The keepers successfully found him a mate. They'll be having their first date soon. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. To the flag of the United States of America. And to the republic for which it stands. One nation under God. Indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Seniors, please check your email for an important message regarding choosing a senior ball venue. Watch the attached video and vote using the Google form. The form is closing Friday, October 9th, so please vote soon. Contact Ms. Conan, Mrs. Mitiga, so your officers, if you have any questions. The deadline for turning in student... The deadline for turning in student council nomination packets and support signatures has been extended until October 1st. Any questions, please send an email or Google Hangouts message to Mr. Hart at rhart at esmschools.org.